Hello everyone, this is Mr. Mix here, or Menacing Mix, whichever you prefer. I just want to give you guys a quick video today. Nothing major, but I thought I would share it with you because anytime I get a new product from Mishimoto, I always want you guys to be the first to see it before I go ahead and add it on to my project car. So I'm just going to keep it very simple, but before we get right into the product itself, I first want to give a big thanks to Rick out of Delaware, who works over at Mishimoto. He is in the public relations department. Rick, he went ahead and along with giving me my next product here that I need for my project, he also blessed me with this lovely banner as you see here. I've always wanted to get me one of these and it was just like he was reading my mind. So Rick, thank you so much again for supplying that for me. Now, let's get into why we're here. And why we are here is because I need to keep my project ride for the past 20 years. I need to keep this vehicle cold. The older a vehicle gets, obviously the motor is also getting old as well, unless you are getting a fresh new motor that's been port polished, whatever. But until then, always, always keep your vehicle at its coolest. Mishimoto.com is the place to do it. So we're going to get right into it by opening up its contents. Dun, 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 dun. Now, for what you all may be seeing, it's like, what is that roll of tape doing in there? Is he moving something? No, I am not. I'll get to this in just a moment. But first, I want to talk about these lovely Mishimoto radiator hoses here. Now, I just had a lovely assistant, but I don't. So... I'm going to take this one out because this one is most forgiving. Take a look at the hosiery here. Whoops. There we go. Now, crafted very well, very durable. So I'm pretty sure Mishimoto, they test their products out, you know, in their research and development team. So we know that this is going to last for quite some time. The one that I currently have on my block right now at the shop, they've never been used, but the motor has been sitting, you know, and the stock, the stock radiator hoses, they were looking a little bit worn out, even though they had zero miles on them. They were, you know, were not in the best of conditions, so I'd rather be safe than sorry, okay? But back to... here now okay basically I'll just leave it as is this is actually this is basically heat defensive tape and what it does it reflects the heat off of your you know onto your your tape here so basically it's just an addition or an additive to help reduce heat now keep in mind this is not a power adder okay it still says here reflective tape so it is to basically allow the heat to escape the areas where you are putting or indicating the tape onto your car, which mainly you want to put it to the engine bay area or where I'm going to be putting mine. That is my 99 Honda Civic bonnet right here. Okay. Now I'm going to put, this is the inside of the bonnet. Okay. And the inside of the bonnet, you see these decals, Fidanza, Autometer, KNN, uh, rota things like that once I get those decals removed I will be putting in the yes the tape okay and that will help keep things cool I do have other things that are designed to keep my vehicle cool as well so not to worry these are just things that will help in addition and I just want to share it with you all and I'm pretty sure you know car guys car girls all alike we may think about these things, but we may also forget about them. So I just wanted to say as a heads up, in case you guys don't have it on your car, check out Mishimoto.com. They can be able to hook you up with what you need over there, okay? Um, next thing I just want to, again, tell you guys about, I got a lot of new content coming up today. So make sure that you check out Instagram, Facebook, okay, and Twitter, because I will also be posting on Twitter, Twitter today. Uh, this man, I can't release his name, but this guy is official here in Georgia. He's working basically by himself. 
I will drop his photo once my vehicle has been turned over. We got the ECU tune. We got some numbers popping. I just kind of want that to be the last minute surprise for you all because I can't give credit just to myself alone. Me, I am just an enthusiast. Yes, I do tune here and there, but as far as for the time, I just do have time to give these little videos like this. And, you know, the guy that I'm telling you about, my tuner, he's an amazing person. So I'll just leave it like that. Guys, thank you so much for keeping my videos in mind. Right now, my little uh, project car here. This is actually a 1979 Chevrolet El Camino, okay? So a little bit of serious business going on. I'm not going to display the whole thing because I told you I keep this short and sweet. For those who know me best, back in the 813 of Tampa, Florida, yeah, you've already seen what's underneath this uh, car cover here. So expect for more. Expect for more content on my Honda Civic today. Guys, girls, it is lovely, okay? Yo, make sure you attain your dreams, all right? Respect yourself, respect others. And as always, thanks for watching. Peace.